What's good, y'all? Check this out. I'm about to put y'all on some game, okay? Just put the kids to sleep. They upstairs. Got no case pregnant with number four. Let me show y'all something. You see this here? I just want y'all to see something. Okay. 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 See? So, this is what you call a pregnant slumber. Pregnant slumber. Pregnant slumber. It don't matter what I say, what I do. She's comfortable here asleep. Now, in the very beginning, when she was pregnant with, with Jackson, I didn't understand that. I would think, in my mind, I cannot wake her up out of this sleep. In my mind, I'm like, this can't be comfortable. So typically, I would wake her up, right? Once I wake her up, we go back in the room. She can't fall back to sleep. Now she pissed, so you know what she would want to do? Discuss why I woke her up out of her sleep to make her go into the back room. Y'all done seen this many a time. I already said I'm not falling asleep. So if I'm not falling asleep, you wasting time here recording and whatnot. Just turn the movie on. I'm not I'll, falling asleep. I not. want. Kadeem, I'm not. If you not. fall. A few moments later. <laughs> Go to bed. Go to bed. Go to bed. I'm not even asleep though. Come on, man. I'm not. Yo, if you would watch the movie and not watch me, then you would know that I'm not asleep. I'm a vet in the game now. This pregnancy number four. So you know what I do? I leave her. But I'm gonna make sure she's set up. See the scarf? Leave the head scarf right here. Cause she may wake up in the middle of the night and realize she don't got a scarf, but if she see the scarf, she know I got her. Move the tea. If you move the tea when she wake up, she don't kick the tea and then be mad that the tea that she left there is dead. Move the tea. Put her slippers right here by her feet so that when she step down, the slippers is right there. In the past, I would wait. She good. She back in it. I've learned too, if you talk during the stretch, they're more likely to wake up. Once they get settled in a posture like this, ain't no waking them up. But this is why it's important. Leaving them to sleep is self-care for us. Self-care for us. Self-care for us. You want to know why? If you wake her up, when you go in that bed at night, you ain't getting no sleep. She going to be aggravated. Ain't nothing going to get done. But at least if you leave her here and she wake up aggravated because she is going to wake up aggravated because she's pregnant. So there's nothing you can do right in this situation. But get some sleep. Get some sleep. Get some sleep. Leave her here. Leave the TV on because they like the white noise. Look, look. You hear that snore? That's a pregnant snore. This is a dad self-care moment. Right now, you leaving her for her sanity, but more importantly for yours. I remember these days. Just one of those days when a girl goes to just one of those days. If you 
If you don't shut the hell up, I can hear you mouthing it. Shut up. Because let me tell you right now, you probably thinking, I can't be right. If I leave her, she going to be mad. But if I tell her to come, she going to be mad. You right. The only thing you can control is you getting some sleep. Because regardless of what you do, she going to wake up aggravated because she pregnant. Trust me, I done been here three times. It's number four. So I'm leaving her for my sanity. See this blanket? I'm going to put this blanket on her. Make sure you need the blanket. Make sure she good. Bow. And everything is all love. See that? I'm already doing too much. I'm going to leave the blanket. Hmm? You good? Cause this is what's gonna happen. She gonna wake up in the morning, right? She gonna be like, babe, why you left me? You left me in there by myself. And I'm gonna be like, babe, you just look comfortable. She gonna be mad. She gonna have an attitude. But you know who won't have an attitude? You. You wanna know why? Because you slept. Because you slept. Because you slept. Get yourself a good six, seven, maybe even eight hours. You can wake up. She gonna be all over the place, but she gonna be rested. And trust me, she they always start off mad, but then once they realize how they being, they go back to being normal. Kay gonna start up mad. You left me, can't believe you. It's hot. You alright, baby? He turned 18. I got you. See, I'm right here. I'm, she think I'm here. Watch, I'm on. It's on, it's on 80. What you want me to put it to? 80? Yeah, it's on 80. 68. 68? Yeah. All right. I'm not putting it on 68. I got you. She put it on 80. She don't want to put it on 80. Seventy-five. I put it on sixty-eight, baby. You good? Mm -hmm. You need anything? No, thank you. See what I'm saying? I'm in here with mom. I'm gonna go check on the boys. All right? She don't need nothing. I'm saying. But you gotta get out of there when the getting is good. Cause if you disturb her too much, she gonna wake up out of attitude. She gonna wake up tomorrow, she gonna be mad cause I left her. But then she gonna be like, can't believe you left me that and that and that. Then she gonna be fine. Then she gonna come back and be like, hey. what's up? What's up? Huh? Nothing. Nah, I'm right here. You good? You wanna finish watching Chop? See? I'm trying to talk to y'all. Now I'm gonna trap back here. She gonna wake up in the morning with an attitude. And she gonna be like, I was mad at you, <laughs> and I don't know why. But I'm gonna be rested, so I'm gonna just say, Come here, come here, lay on daddy, lay on daddy. Okay. Okay. Huh? A few moments later.
sleep on both sides of the bed, baby. What's good?